Good afternoon, Tigers. Welcome to Tiger Vision News. I'm Jeb, and this is my co-host, Klein. Thanks for joining us today. The Student Council can, can food drive us here. Get ready to help out the hungry by bringing in your donations. There are going to be several activities planned for us during the food drive that will give us the opportunity to contribute money. Here's Mrs. Carter to fill us in. Hi, Maddie here with Mrs. Carter. When is the canned food drive this year? Well, I'm glad you asked. It is November 14th through the 18th, and then we're picking it up after we get back from Thanksgiving, November 28th through December 2nd. What special events are coming up during the canned food drive? Well, we're going to do sabotage, except this year it's going to be um, between the classes so um, and in the cafeteria. So which class can be and sabotage the other class. So we're pretty excited about that. We're also doing, again, the You Can Share Food Drive. So donate cans and you get a ticket or you can donate a dollar and you get four tickets and it goes into a pool for your chance to get to go on a field trip to the food bank, which is really pretty fun and we have a blast doing it. And then the other thing we're gonna do is Macho Man. So if you don't know what Macho Man is, it's a beauty pageant with our different organizations uh, and we pick who is our macho man and it's a dollar to go watch it and trust me you don't want to miss it it's a good time where do students drop off cans for the drive um they'll be in the cafeteria and up at, up at the front why should we help out hungry people well when you have enough food that you can share there's realize there's some people that are having a hard time getting by and having a hard time uh, feeding themselves or their family. So if you have a little extra, it's it's the good thing to do. It's the right thing to do. And especially with student council, we're very service minded. And so we want to definitely help the community. So come and bring food, bring money, all that good stuff. Thank you. It's going to be a lot of fun. So get ready to do your part and participate in the events and help put an end to hunger here on the South Plains. Now let's get, now let's go see if we can find out more about the rules of sabotage. Hi, I'm Joe Beer. Me. Explain the rules of sabotage. The rules of sabotage, very easy. Uh, pennies are good. Silver and dollar bills are bad. So what they do is, as the buckets fill, you want more pennies in your bucket than you do silvers and, and dollars. And the way you do sabotage is, if I'm putting money in my bucket, I'm putting pennies, etc., Okay, if I'm putting them in the other class's bucket, I'm going to put silver to sabotage them and dollar bills to sabotage them, make it count against them. But Ms. Hammonds has also said the rule that the blue lines that are all on the buckets, if you as a class pass that line in your bucket, you get free seating till Christmas is what it boils down to. That's the simple rules of sabotage. Put pennies in your bucket. Put silver and dollar bills in all the other people's bucket. When is the game over? Oh, we're going to do it about two weeks worth or so. What are the prizes? The prizes, it doesn't matter what y'all's prizes are because the teachers are going to win. We get free restaurant things and we get to wear blue jeans when we go to school and we get to make fun of all the 6th, 7th, and 8th graders and that's the only prizes that matter. Now y'all sorry prizes, y'all get something other like free seating until Christmas or something. It really doesn't matter because y'all are not going to win. The teachers are going to win no matter what I have to do. Buy, cheat, steal, beat kids up, it doesn't matter. We'll put them in ISS for the whole rest of the day if we have to to keep them from putting money in our bucket. That's all that matters. Thank you. Here's a look at a few of today's announcements. The academic UIL competition is next week. It's Tuesday out at Cooper. All participants will get to miss most of the school day. They've been practicing hard and are ready to show off their skills. Don't forget to go to the book fair. Now let's check in with Ashley and see what's in our forecast. Hey guys, I'm Ashley here with the weather. Your current conditions are partly cloudy, 54 degrees, winds northeast 10 miles per hour, and a 20% chance of rain. Our five day forecast is a, it's cool temperatures the next few days with little chance of rain. I'm Ashley with the weather. Back to you. Thanks, Ashley. Now let's find out what's going on in sports. Hello, FMS sports fans. I'm Frank, and this is Peel, and here's a look at today's sports. Basketball season starts tomorrow. The teams are practicing hard, getting ready to have a great season. All the teams play in scrimmages tomorrow afternoon. The girls play at Heritage. The boys play over at Terra Vista. The games start at 5 o'clock. Practice hard, Tigers. Now let's see what's been happening in pre -ath. Hi, I'm Brixie with Carson, Jerome, Lewis. What do you like most about pre -ath? 
playing Ariel. 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 What do you hope to learn from the coaches this year? Our positions. How to run. How to play it. Thank you. I'm Corbin here with Lucas. Jeremy. What do you look forward to learning this year in Priya? What are the questions, Brooks? Uh, Brooks. Ariel. I mean, <laughs> uh, my position. What do, what, what do you want to do next year? Uh, play the linebacker that I'm playing. Play my position. Thank you. I'm Corbin here with Coach Tipton. What, what are the students doing in pre ath now? You know, right now we're uh, working out. Have what's called workout Wednesdays a whole lot, and uh, building up core strength, getting a little stronger. How many students do you have? You know, overall in both the groups, somewhere around 80. What's your favorite thing about teaching? You know, it would have to be the kids. Uh, they pretty much what what keep keep someone my age around is uh, the enthusiasm and uh, trying to help them someday to become a tiger. Thank you. That's a look at today's sports. Back, Back to you. you. That's all we have today. Thanks for watching Tiger Vision News. Everyone have a great afternoon. We'll see you later. Until then, Tigers.